You okay? <laughs> yeah. Just. Must be a party piece. Spoiling Dingle Doos. You should have told her. I know I didn't. Why is that? Well, because he knows that she doesn't want to hear it. You should have seen the lads yesterday. Oh, they tried to take it in a stride, be all macho about it, but I could see that they were scared. And how are you feeling? Guilty. Eh? <gasps> For giving it to them. Don't be daft. You didn't give it to her. No. I brought it to the party, didn't I? Is this a private party or can anyone join in? I'm in Weebling Way. <laughs> and a little bit more wine. <laughs> Sit your bums down. Yeah. How's Kane? Oh, he's gone home in a huff. <laughs> it's terrible when he's legs, you mean. Hey, that's not funny, Mandy. What? Well, Paddy's still here. Yeah, he's just chatting with Aaron. I hope he doesn't start obsessing. You know what he's like. He won't. I'm gonna make sure of it. And, um, how are you doing? I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. My cancer was caught early, so touch wood, everything's gonna be fine. Right, I wanna make a toast. To our chas. Bravest woman I know. <laughs> Our Our Charles. Charles. Cheers. 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 Oh, look, look, listen, listen. <laughs> Sorry. I don't want to put a dampener on the day, but can, please, can I just say something? Right, go on. Check your breasts, ladies. I didn't. Even though Mum died from breast cancer. Still didn't. I mean, I meant to. <laughs> Thought about it every time I was in the shower. I meant to. And, um, but you know, I was always in a rush, wasn't I? I got things to do. And then I thought, you know what? I'll do it next time. And then guess what? Next time came round and I still flaming didn't. I'm the same. If I'm honest, I'm a bit scared to. Lydia, I think being told by your oncologist that you've got stage four breast cancer is a lot more scarier. True. You know, it's weird, isn't it? There's so many TV programmes that are telling us to check our breasts and we all, we all nod and say, I need to do that. But we need to do it. And then we don't. <laughs> well, I do. Well, good for you. Paddy does. <laughs> Oh, man, too much information. I never check mine. I mean, I know I'm too young anyway, but... No, you're not. <gasps> All right. Honestly, you are never too young. Women are getting diagnosed younger and younger these days. Men get it as well? Yeah, not as many, though. You were lucky. They caught yours early. Mm. Thank you, Dr Liam. <laughs> <laughs> How do you mean? Let's just say he felt it. Yeah. Another bottle, ladies? Yes, please, and not the cheap stuff this time. We're ready now. Hey. Are you okay? Yeah. Just thinking. About what? Come on, you can tell me. I'm gonna have a double mastectomy. I've got an appointment at the hospital tomorrow and I'm going to tell them. Look, have you really thought this through? Lydia, I've thought about nothing else since my diagnosis. Can't risk the cancer coming back. I just can't. I want to see you grow up. I want to see you go to uni, get married. So losing my breasts is small fry in comparison to that. Does anyone else know? No, no, and I, and I don't want them to, OK? I like now I've got enough on the plates without me chucking this into the ring. They're family. Yeah. They want to help. I know they will. 
but they'll also have their opinions and I don't want to hear it, okay? My mind's made up, it's happening. Okay. Most important thing in this is Eve. Yeah, of course. I know how I was when I lost Mum. I was left with the biggest hole in my heart. And I still have it, if I'm honest. And I'm a grown-up. She's just...